The Israeli Defense Forces IDF, are preparing for a possible military strike on Iran's nuclear reserves, after media reports claimed that U.S. President Donald Trump might order a strike before he leaves office in January. For further discussion like the video and subscribe Voice of World and hit the bell icon and share your opinion with us. Tel Aviv has asked the IDF to stand prepared in the event of a strike, based not on any intelligence report or assessment, but a very sensitive period before the president-elect Joe Biden is sworn in on January 20. If the U.S. forces strike Iran, the IDF has to prepare for retaliation directly from the Iranian military or through Iranian proxies in Syria, Gaza, and Lebanon. Earlier, Trump has deliberated on the military strike on Iranian nuclear strike with senior advisors in the White House. The meeting was a consequence of the International Atomic Energy Agency's IAEA report distributed to member states, revealing that Iran's stockpile of low-enriched uranium had reached 2,442.9 kilograms, 5,385.6 pounds, this month. Under the nuclear deal, Iran is allowed to enrich uranium to a purity of up to 3.67%, while it has currently reached 4.5%. Additionally, the deal allows producing up to 300 kilograms of enriched uranium in a particular compound form, UF6, which is the equivalent of 202.8 kilograms of uranium. However, in 2018, Trump withdrew from the nuclear deal reimposing sanctions on Iran. The U.S. president also instructed an airstrike in January 2020 that killed Iran's top general Qasem Soleimani. In retaliation, Tehran ended its commitment to limit its uranium enrichment. The senior White House officials, including Vice President Mike Pence, Secretary of State Mike Pompeo, warned against carrying out the strike, describing the risk of a full-blown conflict with Iran. Thank you for watching Voice of World and what you think just write down in the comment box.